All right, this is a little bit better. Uh, my glove on. Not dropping my camera. Oh, you have left my plow. I know. See what I'm doing, even when I'm holding that. Up from in fucking gear. Getting a little bit dark. Oh, boy, right in my face. Tank of gas would have a little bit more weight and would do a little bit better. But it's in a little bit of a hurry to get out here before a complete dark to get some film in. I don't know if you can see this on camera, the snow flying right at me. It's getting a little bit cold in the eyes. On the way out, I'll get her going a little bit and you'll be able to hear that engine roll right back. Ah, shit. Barely see anything. So, like my eyes. Ah! Uh, uh, it up. now! Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm slowing down. There I got it. Uh, that's what I plowed earlier. Jesus Christ, that's bright. Uh. Oh. Ah, oh, shit. Slow down. Still going down my shirt. Well, jacket. A little bit fucking cold on my chair. Alright, I'm going to go over here. really tell. Should I just zoom in? No, it's not. Can't really fucking tell, can you? Wow, there's an ATV trail over there, but with all that snow, see my foot right, foot's right there. That's about 14 inches or so off the ground. And there's that bank right there. It's up in my fenders. That was a 27 inches tall. Probably another foot above them. 37 inches or so right there. <laughs> Look at my display. Covered in snow. Oh, it's covered in snow. Everything's covered in snow. I didn't even really do anything. Oh, look at that. I got snow. I'm going to put them on uh, screen. I'm going to pause this for a second. Fix it up. 
figured I'd do a quick tutorial or whatever here on how to angle the blade as you tell it's angled all the way. There's this little switch plate down here. Let's see it. I can see it now. There's five holes in it. What we do is lift up this lever, kind of sit it aside a little bit, move us to where we want it. I want it straight ahead because I'm going to be heading out. And it clicks into place. Every now and then this turntable here will freeze and you'll have to knock it free. Which is one thing I don't like. But it's a real good plow. If you get it angled and hooked up right and everything. One of these days, when it's not so cold that I can't get on the ground, I'll show you how the plow is mounted underneath. My dad and I get it hooked up special. And I'll show you that sometime. Alright, I'm getting ready to head out. It's not on my It's not, doesn't freeze. It's in four wheel drive, this is all ice under this. Um, but you're gonna hear the engine roar a little bit. I don't want it to roar too loud. This camera's made to be held with your right hand, but I got hold it with my left because obviously the trigger is throttles over here. And I'm about to run out of fuel, so I'm gonna get going. My clutch and gauge is a little bit late and it's worn out, not going so good. Once I get past this little Ice spot right here. I had an accident right here last year. I slid down the road sideways and went to a bank over there. That wasn't very good, but I didn't break nothing. Okay, this is gonna get really loud because the uh, ATV was designed for 25 and this has got 27s on it with no fuck mode. I really wish I could get some clutch mods for this spot. That was, my dad wants me to leave it original. I'm going to put the camera away now. I don't really want my dad to see it because he doesn't know I got it. <laughs> so, i got to put this away as I said. I'll put this on later tonight. This is 128.09. It's a pretty big snowbank over there. I judge at least four feet tall, so.